Alright guys, finally we got Hogwarts Legacy. Let's hop right into it man. Okay, we got a letter here saying we are pleased to inform you that you have been <coughs> accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year student. Term begins on 1st of September. Preliminary supplies have been collected for you and will accompany you on your journey to the castle. As you may be aware, <coughs> the decree for the reasonable restriction of underage sorcery prohibits the use of magic by those under the age of 17 outside school. However, due to your unique circumstances, the ministry has graciously agreed to allow Professor Elazar Fig to help you hone your spell casting before escorting you from London to the castle for the start of term feasts and starting ceremony. Oh wow, from Weasley, Ron Weasley. <laughs> Professor Weasley. Deputy head mistress, wait. Never mind. Alright, let's start the game, man. Ooh. I've been waiting and looking forward to this. Let's see how in depth this is gonna be. with the black boy because I'm black by the way it's not obvious I see the hairstyles and uh, different features oh this is a face changer I don't think I'm gonna f change the face change the skin color um I don't see a difference. You can put on glasses. Yeah, nah, I need my glasses. So we have the fade right now. Curly fade. It'll be crazy if they have the waves, yo. <laughs> Let's check this out. Oh, snap. Yo, why can't oh, other games give us good hairstyles like this, like 2K, NBA 2K, and these other games, man? Nah, this looks crazy. <laughs> the big boy braids right there. That's definitely a female hairstyle. Whoa. <laughs> this shouldn't even be an option for men, yo. Okay, let's check this one out. Interesting. I wonder if you can change it like during the game. buddy now that's what I think 2k has the waves that's what they got over this yeah, um, I might go with the original one yeah, something like that or was it this one See this one again. It's kind of fly, right? We've changed the color. Wow. Holy oh, shit. <laughs> I'm 
keep it normal, man. Not go too crazy. And check this one out again. Same thing, but just curlier hair. And yeah, you know, the funny thing is, I think um, in the Harry Potter universe, it was like back in the day, right? Wouldn't it be like super racism and shit? <laughs> Even black characters. I don't know. This fade is fly though. I'm mean, gonna stick with that. So you got scars, freckles, and moles, and complexion. Oh, here we go. Wait. Check this. Nah, I don't want no scars. It's like for people who don't know what they're doing, man. I wanna be clean face. Like I never get touched in battle. Changed eye color. Whoa. Like a pit bull. Kind of normal. Wow. I forgot the one he originally had. It's starting to look like contacts now. Go back to, uh, I think it was like this one, right? Yeah, stay with that. I'm not gonna go too in depth with this. Okay, let's check out the voice tones. eager to get to Hogsmeade. What? I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. That was just too... It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. That was quite something. What? A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. So you can make it deeper or light? I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. <laughs> what the fuck? It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. You're gonna set it to normal. Hmm. Should I name him? Let's see. Which is for women, right? Yeah, not like the Witcher, <laughs> so just playing. You must name your character. It's not letting me. Oh, I can type it in. Damn, I have to make like a fictional name and shit. I'll go with my real name. For the first name. Kenny Potter. <laughs> uh, the heir apparent. Let's see. Anything else I want to change before we go? Did I miss any cool, cool stuff? Uh, let me look at the faces again. See if there's anything more closely aligned. 
Nah, that's the face that, uh, the other pre-made face. Whoa. Yeah, let's stick with that. I think we're good to go, man. Start the journey. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell Looking casting. Spiffy. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the time begins. Whoa. Oh, <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theatergoers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eliasar. Mm, someone's listening. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. He's worried about something. Carriage. Ooh, who's this? He knew that guy was watching us. Didn't even tell us, man. Must be super bad. He's scared to talk about it. Companion. A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. Kenny Potter. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> have you seen this? They got the interactive uh, newspapers. Uh, differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, well, what is that? I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? Is that who was chasing us? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. 
That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Uh oh. It's meant Nor for us. I. I get that young talent. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? Damn. You killed your boy already? <laughs> uh, this guy died off the rip. Wow. Go skydiving now. Grab it, grab it. Oh. Uh. The key. Give me your hand. I you. Ooh. The teleportation. At least we got the key. Damn, we could have been dead right there in one chomp. Are you alright? You're alive by pure luck right now. You're hurt. Yeah. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Wigan Weld Potion. Alright, so down on the diagonal pad. Directional pad is a uh, heel. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he. What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage midair? A typical dragon would never... Professor? Sir... Is that Ragnar? Not God. Where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. These graphics are incredible. I'm feeling better, sir. If you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. The graphics look as good as the cutscenes, man. That's what I always wanted in a game like this. Next gen technology. We can't run. We're slow walking. How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. Do you think the port key was meant to lead us there? I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Mind your step. Okay, we can run now. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes, a powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Look at these surroundings, man. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. I guess his wife died a long time ago because he didn't seem that distraught. Why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. 
spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Basic cast. Okay, R2. Excellent! Use your camera to select an active target. Hmm. I'll see how it is once I start and I'll change it if I don't like it. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. These graphics, bro. Slow walking again. Ah, up there. Okay. That's like any other adventure game to show you which wall to climb. The white lines are whatever indicator there is. Well, you going that way? Let's see what's this way. Exactly, yo. Just to give you guys a hint, whenever you play adventure games, don't always follow the obvious path. Check everywhere first. You never know what's hiding. And these games love to hide stuff from you. So, first secret unlocked. We got a chest. Don't let them rush We're you either. Now. It's just ahead. Yourself. This guy is powerful, bro. He saved our ass in the uh, the carriage. Teleported us. He can do all this, yo. Imagine all the other bosses in the game. If this random guy is this strong. Almost there. Professor Fake. Well, he is a professor, so. Okay, we can't go down there. Oh, is this gonna be a fight? Like the. Why did uh, someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That port key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. This is the exact circle they showed in the uh, example for the fighting, right? Okay, the minimap shows your surroundings with the uh, arrow, purple arrow. And our current objective is that. And you can toggle quest objective details. Cool. Let's try angle. Nothing. Ooh, we can dodge. What if we can jump and roll? Ooh, we can. Professor, it's a mural of some kind. Mm, perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. Okay, to go around this way. According to the mini map, Professor, this statue. This may have been his home. Let's 
Damn, I can't get over how it looks. Yo, look at the water. Nice. Just testing to see if there's anything in these uh pots. Okay, we see that symbol over there to the that left. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? We're about to find out. Ooh, I hear that creepy voice. What's this? Professor Fig! Whoa. Should we wait on him or just go in? Now he's coming. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. And he can't see anything. There's that glow again. Only we like can. The glow on the port key container. What in Merlin's name? Wake the goblin. What? Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. Yeah, where are we? Hello? Presume. <laughs> Precisely. The key. Mm -hmm. Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. To you. Uh, keep your hands inside the cart if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> so who did he recognize? The old man? Or us? How many folks are there? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You'll want to take a breath. That's so cool. A what? Waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Damn, it's fire. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Damn, Settle 400 in. years? Quite a distance to go. So it's one of the originals. Number. This guy's Vault intense. Twelve. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. Hmm? The on 
armband that guard was wearing was glowing. Like the glow you saw on the porky container? No, darker. I saw that same glow on the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just oh, wondering shit. about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. The guy's gonna come and rob us as soon as we get what we collect. Here we are. Look at that. When was the last time the fun fort ride. was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. Damn, a whole vault. Vault 12. Thank you for your help. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key yeah, and then close the door. Wait! Best of luck. <sighs> Professor? That was certainly unexpected. Yeah, but he can't see Let that glow on the wall, but we can see it, right? There must be something here. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio. For reveal? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Says so steady your wand with the L, the left uh, stick, and then guide it along the symbol path to learn the spell. Press the corresponding input and prompt it to accelerate your wand's motion, okay? Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. Oh, my bad. <laughs> it's the left. Wait. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to Rebellion. discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Now how do I get this off the screen? Oh, okay, just press it again. Damn it, got real dark. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean to earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. A lot of these spells have like English, like root words. Kinda. Revelio, Loomis, Repero. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. They need to explain why only we can see it and not him. Lumos. What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir, I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. 
That statue? What statue? Damn. I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm, perhaps you should cast Lumos. What? Wait. First of all, anyway, let's go. Maybe I wasn't aiming it properly. So I have Reveal and Lumos. This one is an R2. Hold R2 and tap triangle to cast or extinguish. Lumos, well done. Not the whole Now yeah. the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. There we go. Looks like you're underwater. Okay, go for protect. Oh shit. Oh my god. I love this. Should count as a parry, right? Ooh, get that dodge, boy. Ooh, a parry. Let's go. close that was fire professor professor fig professor where are you this isn't good where am I supposed to go what's happening the wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere okay Follow the light. Ah, that's where they're leading me. That glow again. So we're gonna fight again. But by ourselves. Rebellion. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Lumos. Okay. I need to align these statues with their reflections. Is that it? 
was this one too. Oh, so do I like put it out? What? Lumos. Yeah, hurry up, man. It's right there. That was all three at the same time. Seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. Potato. Easy money, man. Come on. Get that lockdown pack. Whole triangle during protect of the stun enemies. The stupefy counter attack. Some enemies take extra damage. Okay. Ooh, that's nice. Ah. Can't hold it too long. Oh my god. It's a lot of these guys, man. Health up. Lumos. Okay, now we can do this sprint. I've been trying to do that the whole time. Oh. The person must be going through it right now. How's he gonna find this way? Why is it going so dark like that? Damn, can we breathe? Are we underwater? at the beginning what is this place I don't know but I found this floating above that basin I'll be past the that test is no mere basin that is a pensive for viewing memories I wonder The memory of his wife, I guess. Follow my lead. Can we get to put a face in it? Who is this? The guy who created this place? The architects? All is in place. Porky is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. 
We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. They're not lip synced correctly. They've Did done you guys notice can. that? Like the audio was behind their lips. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Ooh, is that Someone's the guy? Coming. Nice set us up. Yeah. I don't know. But and he said perhaps the other guy, so did he survive? Yeah, the guy with the red I band. This is boss. Right. Ramrock. What? Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever gonna visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. Hell no. <coughs> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that... The instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. Oh, you're I dead. Was to grant access <laughs> only to one with the key. That was too obvious, bro. I'll just shut up. <laughs> I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hopefully, we can survive this. Well. Perhaps your young friend here will be the one. Man, he doesn't even need a wand. Yo, teleport us out like before, buddy. Ah, they sensed the dark, the, the, the dark magic. Activated like a sentinel. Oh my goodness. Yeah, get the reinforcements, boy. We should flee now while we can. Oh, man. Ah, the reverse wall trick. Are you all right? Fine, sir. Bro, are you all right? I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Damn, he didn't even need a wand either. He's just where are we? Using his hands like. Dragon Ball Z. It can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Sorting ceremony. What an intro, guys. Wow. This game is insane so far.
feels like we're watching another movie in Harry Potter. I love it. What an intro. forward to this game now to what else to have in store and that was the beginning bosses well he might show up later on and we fight him and some stronger enemies even afterwards oh good we haven't missed the sorting ceremony I'm no expert but that seems more appropriate now I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. De of course. Definitely. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Okay, what's going on here? Phineas, Nigellus, Black. Prepare yourself to meet the Headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were... Damn, you missed it. Complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. Hey guys, you don't listen, man. I'll be in touch. So stupid. Nice. We're in the Harry Potter glasses. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. I don't remember the classes. I think I remember by the colors. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Hmm. I wonder... Hmm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Hmm. What is it? This guy sounds creepy as hell, bro. Ambition and curiosity. Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Hmm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition. An eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. This is the house that nobody liked from the movies, from what I remember, right? That's with the uh, the guy with the slick back hair and his father. It says the sorting hat will take your choice into account, I'm sorting you into a house. Slytherin house known for cunning 
ambition and a hunger for power. Patience, loyalty, hard work. Daring, bravery, bravery, chivalry. Intelligence, creativity, and wit. I mean, obviously I'm gonna go with the lion, but let me see. Slytherin. I like this as well, though, like the description. I'm like a mixture of a few of these. hard time between these two. I know Gryffindor, I think that's the Harry Potter house. And my name is P Kenny Potter, so <laughs> I guess we're going here. Possess a willingness to forge your head alone when you must. Better be Gryffindor! There we go. Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Ah, uh, come on. Enough. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether, but don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. All right, let the adventure begin, I guess. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm Professor Weasley. Would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. It was her in the letter, so he chose right, right? As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Oh, never mind. I guess right this way. it didn't matter. She would be the same person doing the same thing. No matter what you chose, she's the headmistress. It's most uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. This should be quite an adventure. I'm looking forward to it. I remember the first time I entered the Gryffindor common room after being sorted. You were a Gryffindor? I am a Gryffindor. Oh, never mind. Never could remember the password when I was a girl, however. Password? Password? The password is Grata Domum. Grata Domum. You may enter. <laughs> Her name is Fat Lady. Wow. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Interesting. He was right though, I do want to explore Hogwarts and outside. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Nice, the free roaming begins. Alright, perfect place to stop the episode. Uh, this intro was insane, man. Basically gave us a tutorial while making it seem like an important mission, which it was. And we got a taste of some of the bosses and that dope ass 
Sentry. It's pretty cool. Anyway, I can't wait to dive into this, man, guys. Make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and I'll see you in the next episode. Peace.